Welcome back, Patriots. We hope you've had a great weekend and a lovely week. Yeah, um, well, National Kindness Day is coming up this Monday, so in honor of that, we're going to have Kenny's segment, One Love. Right off the bat. Yeah, let's check that out. In what ways are you kind to yourself? Oh, what ways am I kind to myself? Um, I usually try and give myself uh, time outside, um, whether exercising or sitting on the front porch, just to give me time to regroup. And what do you think you could do to be kinder to yourself? Hmm. Maybe learn to say no. And why should we be kind to ourselves? Well, when I was in college, I took a class called Out of Apples, and um, it basically said that we have to give to ourselves or we won't have any apples left to give out um, to other people. So I've thought about that for a lot of years, and um, I think it's true. All right, that's a real good analogy, one love. All right. How can we be kind to people we aren't close with? Um, a simple good morning, or how are you doing, or hey, I like your shirt today. Now, how do you feel when someone you aren't close with is kind to you? It makes me happy. Gives you, gives you a warm, fuzzy feeling. <laughs> and how often did you say you would go out of your way to help somebody out, even if maybe you don't like it, maybe if you actively dislike them? Not often enough. Well, there you go. Well, <laughs> try and work on that more. One love. In what ways are you kind to yourself? Like, like, what do you do for self-care? I mostly uh, just like lay down and listen to music for hours at a time. Yeah, that's good. I rock with some music. Um, how do you think you could be kinder to yourself? What could you switch up, make yourself feel a little better? Uh, I guess being less hard on myself. Yeah. If I mess up or something. Yeah, that's a good way to think about it. And, and why should we be kind to ourselves? What do we, what do we get from it? Uh, you feel better, you feel happier, and you just generally have a brighter spirit. Yeah, I have to say I agree. One love. One love. How do you feel when people are kind to you? Um, it feels great, and I really enjoy when people are kind to one another. Okay, and how do you feel when you are kind to other people? It makes me feel good. Like, I feel great when I do that. Okay. Now, do you think you should get something for being kind to people for nothing? Like, should you be rewarded? Should, should something come your way? No, it's something we should all do. Okay. And I uh, see, I would argue that the reward is that good feeling you get when you're kind to other people. That is true. Yeah. All right. Hey, I appreciate you, brother. One love. I always love that segment. It's so cute. Mm -hmm. I love the, all the positivity. It's great. It's really gets you thinking about what's good in life, you know? Yes, yeah, Kenny's yeah. very good at that. Uh, mm -hmm. We have an old segment coming back now that some seniors have a more of an idea about what they want to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, we've got Senior Spotlight. <laughs> Welcome to Senior Spotlight. I'm here with Justin Urbina. Yes, you are. Yes, yeah. yes, I am. <laughs> so we're going to ask him some questions. So what do you plan on doing after high school? Well, I want to go to Casanova College, mm -hmm. uh, and I want to major in studio art with a minor in illustration and animation. That is so cool. Well, thank you. I would never have known that. I love um, it. Um, what are you most looking forward to for your senior year? Um, I mean, honestly, kind of just getting it over with. You know, no, nothing wrong with it. It's just kind of I'm really have my sights set on looking forward in the future. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. What's your favorite school memory? School memory? Um, probably, I mean, the, the Geneseo field trip was fun junior year. It was very long, but mm -hmm. I mean, it was just pretty fun. Solid field trip. Solid, like, 9.5 out of 10. <laughs> the, the .5 is from the uh -huh. eight-hour drive. Yeah. But... <laughs> I guess, I guess I'd probably say that's it. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, what are your song or show recommendations? Song or show. Okay, so for mm -hmm. show, it's, 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 it's a bit of a kooky one. It's called Neon Genesis Evangelion. So good. So good. Delight. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's a really good show. And uh, song, I mean, Shadows of the Night by Pat Benatar. You know? Yeah. Good, good song. Mm -hmm. It's a comfort song. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and last but not least, any shout outs? Uh, shout outs, uh, Delaney Tam, uh, Nicholas uh, Allen Paul Snow, <laughs> uh, Greg Snow, uh, Corey Beaumont, of course, um, Annika something or other. Uh, That's it. That's yeah. all. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. Thank you so much for coming in, Justin. Mm -hmm. It's always so much fun talking to you. Yep. 
Mm -hmm. um, and then up next, we have a very cute segment that I personally love, Fist Bumps with Nick. Mm -hmm. um, I think all the questions are about kindness this week, right? Yeah, spreading positivity yeah. in our school community. All right, we'll see how that goes. How do you show kindness every day? Um, to help somebody when some somebody drops something. Really? That's a great way to show kindness. Can I get a fist bump? Thank you. What is kindness to you, Hunter? Something that feels good. How do you show that? By being nice. Are you nice to people? Yes. Can I get a fist bump? Thanks, Hunter. Why is it important that we're kind to others? Because it tells others that you can always be strong and kind. Yeah. I like that answer. Can I get a fist bump? Good answer. Why is it important that we're kind to others? Because it's important that people don't feel bad about things. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, this is fun. Thank you. What is kindness to you? Being friendly. Why is it important? Um, because it includes people and you're not left alone. That's a great answer. Can I get a fist bump? What a cute segment. I absolutely love fist bumps with Nick. Yep, thank mm -hmm. you for all answering all of Nick's questions. Mm -hmm. yeah. So tomorrow is Veterans Day. We had our lovely Veterans Day ceremony this morning, which we hope you all enjoyed. But tomorrow we have the day off. So yeah. it's important to just take a moment and remember uh, why we have that. Yeah. You know, be thankful for our veterans. Yeah. They do a lot for us. They do. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. All right. That's well, it for this week. Yep. And we'll see you soon. Yep. Bye.